no messages for you, Commander. I've got an appointment with Shaira in three months. I can't wait. We're flying into the eye of the storm, and you're thinking about some Asari prostitute? Hey, watch it. It's not like that at all. She's so... she's... Uh, you wanna... Commander. I assume everything is going well up here? Shh. Joker? I can tell when it's listening. I am always listening, Mr. Moreau. I know. That's it for now. See you, Commander. Commander, can I help you with something? I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. Already? I'm not big on forcing these talks, Shepard. We'll Let's talk later. Commander. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Later, updating crew dental records. All Cerberus personnel have cyanide capsules and molars. Primitive, ocular nerve flashbangs harder to disarm. Anything else? Have you got a minute to talk? Later, anything else? I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. Hey, got a minute? The commander has put together an impressive team. I've never worked with so many aliens before. They're a small army. We might just pull this mission off. Commander, what could I do? You have a minute, Miranda? There's a lot to do, Shepard. Maybe another time. I'll let you work. Of course, Commander. Shepard, need me Have for you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. Shepard. Just checking in, making sure you're acclimatizing. The hold is too open, not enough cover. Armor is limited. Warlord Granth would target here to scatter heavy cargo, then focus on engines. That's what tank imprints show about human ships anyway. It's how I learned from the tank. Old pictures where memory is. Like holding a book for a child. Just remember this picture after picture. No help with finding a reason to care. What other human info was floating around in there? Less than a finger deep to sever your spine. You're soft. Salarian, Sasari, all soft. Quarians, not so much. Turians, you have to work the blade, I guess. Don't see much point to it, though. <laughs> much point. <laughs> uh, never mind. Something must move you. You're as genetically Krogan as you can get. I see suffering, the dead, and I think weak. I'm supposed to be strong. My guts were grown from thousands more worthy. The dead were weak. If they were strong, I wouldn't be needed. I don't know why Okir started teaching. When he turned on the tank the first time, I screamed. Weak, pitiful. 
So you started small, but you became what you are. Not everyone gets that chance. I'm built for strength, but didn't earn it. I just am. Those dead were strong enough to try, even if they lost. The perfect Krogan, ignoring what made me. No strength in that. I'll take another look at what happened to the Krogan. Find a reason to care about it. Shepard. Just checking in, making sure you're acclimatizing. The humans talk too much. Like the tank. Come back later. Anything in your tank imprints that can be... Might have something I could put together. Don't know how useful it will be. Reserves at fifty per cent. Probe away. launched. Launching probe. Launching probe.
launching probe. Launching probe. Probe away. Probe launched. Launching probe. Probe launched. Launching probe. Probe away. launched. Launching probe.
launching probe. Probe launched. launched. Launching probe. Probe launched. Launching probe. Launching probe.
launching probe. Probe launched. Probe launched. Probe away. Launching probe. Probe launched. Launching probe. Probe launched. Probe away. Probe away. Launching probe. Probe launched. Probe launched. Probe away. Probe away. Probe launched. Launching probe. Probe 
have launched. Launching probe. I have detected an anomaly. Launching probe. Scans have found something. Launching probe.
have used half our fuel. launched. Launching probe. Probe launched. away. Launching probe. Launching probe. Probe away. launched. Launching probe. Probe launched. Probe launched. Launching probe. Launching probe. Probe away.
Welcome to the Purgatory, Shepard. Your package is being prepped, and you can claim it shortly. As this is a high-security vessel, you'll need to relinquish your weapons before we proceed. I can't do that. Everyone stand down. Commander, I'm Warden Kirill, and this is my ship. Your weapons will be returned on the way out. You must realize this is just a standard procedure. It's my standard procedure to keep my gun. Let them proceed. Our facility is more than secure enough to handle three armed guests. We're bringing Jack out of cryo. As soon as the fund's clear, you can be on your way. If you'll follow me to out-processing for the pickup, Commander. Let's go. Cell Block 2. As you can see, we keep tight control over the population. Each prisoner's cell is a self-contained modular unit. I've blown a few out the airlocks as an example. The ship is made up of 30 cell blocks identical to this one. We house thousands of criminals. We can put the whole place in lockdown on a moment's notice. Nothing goes wrong here. Can you tell me about Jack? Cerberus hasn't told you. Jack is the meanest handful of violence and hate I've ever encountered. Dangerous, crazy, and very powerful. You'll see soon enough. How'd you end up running this ship? I was in law enforcement on Palavin and got sick of seeing criminals escape out into the galaxy to carry on with their crimes. Bounty hunters aren't dependable. Eventually, I hit upon this idea. Keep the criminals in space, and the galaxy is a safer place. You do this because you think it's necessary? Every day I see the worst sapient life has to offer. Governments are soft, unwilling to make the hard choices. Someone had to stand up and make the galaxy safe. How'd you end up running this ship? I was in law enforcement on Palavin, and bounty hunters aren't. Eventually, I hit upon this idea. Maintaining a population this size in space can't be cheap. We can cut corners that governments can't, and each prisoner brings in a fee from his home world. These individuals are violent, and their home planets pay well to keep them here. What happens if the home world doesn't want to pay? We explain that we can't maintain the prisoner without their help. So, we'll be forced to release him back onto his homeworld, at an unspecified place and time. So it's an extortion racket? You don't have to agree with my methods, but don't question my motives. These are despicable people, and I'm keeping them locked up. Let's get on with this. I bet people try pretty hard to get out. We're in space. They have nowhere to go, and they know it. But still, we exercise extreme caution. These are dangerous individuals. We have many ways to control the population. I'm going to confirm that the funds from Cerberus cleared. Out processing is straight down this hallway. Just keep going past the interrogation rooms and the Supermax wing. I'll catch up with you later, Shepard. something I can do for you? There's no excuse for beating a prisoner who can't fight back. This is a massage compared to what his victims went through. 
This degrades you as much as him. We have orders. You're not important enough to make your own decisions? I admit, I sometimes get tired of this. Does this really get us anything useful? Stop this. For your own sake. Yeah, you're right. Call it off. At least for now. Hey! If you're buying prisoners, can you buy me? Man, I, I don't care where you take me or what you do to me. It's gotta be better than this. We're here for Jack. Jack? Forget what I just said. I don't want to go nowhere with you. I thought this ship was a prison, not a market. Sometimes people buy cons so they can do some punishing of their own, if you understand. Warden sells this to whoever can pay enough. Why are they interrogating that prisoner? You know something? Nah, that's Bimmy. He don't know nothing. He offed someone in the showers yesterday, I think. Guy he killed was worth a lot to the Warden. Yeah, sucks to be Bimmy right now. They're going at it pretty hard. Do they ever kill prisoners by accident? I haven't heard of anyone dying. Warden can't make money off us if we're dead. Funny thing, though. The more a guard does it, the meaner he gets. So they rotate him through. So, what are you in for? I killed a few people. Only about 20 or so. And I blew up that one habitat. Small time compared to most of the guys here. What's it like here? Bad. And you gotta watch out. Damn, but someone's always after your stuff. Your smokes, your clothes, your... pride. I haven't taken a shower in three months. Tell me more about Jack. The worst trouble you ever saw. Mixed with some crazy and way too much biotic power. That's all I'm saying. I should go. Wish I could go. I hear the screaming in my head. It's nice, yeah. This is the Supermax wing. It's off limits. Out processing is back down the hall on your right. They'll bring your package there after the cryo thaw is finished.
Now processing is through the door on the far side of the room. My apologies, Shepard. You're more valuable as a prisoner than a customer. Drop your weapons and proceed into this open cell. You will not be harmed. Maybe I can change your mind. Activate systems! Time to fight! to get Jack out of the ice. If we hack that control, every door on the cell block opens. How else are we gonna get Jack out? I'm doing it. Be ready. Let's go. Warning. Warning. Sounds like heavy fighting. We can use this. Here 
taking heavy mech. <clears throat> <clears throat> It's a 
about to go off! You're valuable, Shepard. I could have sold you and lived like a king. But you're too much trouble. At least I can recapture Jack. Not happening. You're a two-bit slave trader, and I don't have time for it. I do the hard things civil governments are unwilling to. This is for the good of the galaxy. What the hell do you want? You're in a bad situation and I'm gonna get you out of here. Shit, you sound like a pussy. I'm not going anywhere with you. You're Cerberus. Why does it matter if I'm with Cerberus? 
They've been on my ass for years. Anytime I get free, they put a huge bounty on me. That's why Warden Curl figured he'd struck gold when he caught me. She's destroyed Cerberus property and killed Cerberus people. Hence the bounty. You die first. I'm here to ask for your help. You show up in a Cerberus frigate to take me away somewhere? You think I'm stupid? This ship is going down in flames. We can get you to safety and we're asking for your help. We could just knock her out and take her. I'd like to see you try. We're not gonna attack her. Good move. Look, you want me to come with you? Make it worth my while. Join my team and I'll do what I can for you. Don't make promises you can't keep. I bet your ship's got lots of Cerberus databases. I want to look at those files, see what Cerberus has got on me. You want me on your team? Let me go through those databases. I'll give you full access. Shepard, you're not authorized to do that. Oh, it upsets the cheerleader. Even better. You better be straight up with me. So why the hell are we standing here? Move up. Welcome to the Normandy, Jack. I'm Miranda, Shepard's second in command. On this ship, we follow orders. Tell the Cerberus cheerleader to back off, Shepard. I'm here because of our deal. Miranda will let you into the system. Let me know what you find. Hear that, precious? We're going to be friends. You, me, and every embarrassing little secret. I'll be reading down in the hold, or somewhere near the bottom. I don't like a lot of through traffic. Keep your people off me. Better that way. Commander, can I help you with something? I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. Already? I'm not big on force. We'll talk later. Commander. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to Having talk? trouble working between your interruptions and Edie's insistence that insane experiments endanger entire crew. Hard to concentrate. Anything else? I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me.
Jack's tattoos are beautiful. As colorful as her past, I'm sure. I have concerns with her temper, though. You have worries about Jack? I know she'll be solid under fire, but her attitude suggests deep personal issues. She pushes people away, yet approaches sex casually. I don't think she understands her own motivations. I wouldn't be surprised if she makes advances on you. If you want her respect, think twice. I'll do my best not to piss her off. Please warn me if you fail. I want a chance to hide. Anyway, what's up? Do you have a moment I to I always talk? have time for you, Commander. How do you feel about I, being I, assigned? But mostly I feel encouraged. How do you feel I, about I, being assigned? But mostly I feel encouraged. Uh, if any of the crew has important... Isn't that the type of task? I have a degree in psychology. I'm good at sensing when people are overly... You make sure yes. the crew's mental? I look for warnings. We're lucky to have Thank someone you, with your... What else would you like to know? How do you feel I, about being assigned? But mostly I feel encouraged. That'll be all. I'll be here if you need any. The elusive man wishes to speak to you in the debriefing room, Commander. Commander, what can you I do? You have a minute, Miranda? There's a lot to do, Shepard. Maybe another I'll let time. you work. Of course, Commander. Shepard, talk to you later. I'll be here if you need me. Shepard, have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in. Talk to you later. I'll be here if you need me. Shepard. Just checking in. Making sure you're... I was just... just sitting here thinking. The picture. I'm finally starting to get it. There's a tank imprint. The battle at Canrum. A dead Turian. Stripped. You don't see them out of their armor much. A Krogan boot on his head. And a claw hammer. It's under the brow plate, pulling it back, right? Eyes have gone black, and you see tension in the muscle. You can feel it ready to snap. I get it. Canrum isn't ringing a bell. Death of Shiagar, female warlord. Turians killed her so they were hunted down and made examples. Even if they won the war, it was the last push before the rebellions ended. Maybe I had to be there, but I don't get the joke. There's no joke. It's just great. It's a Turian and he's being torn apart for what they did. I felt nothing before, but now I get it. It was a good fight. The enemy was destroyed to punish them all and send a message. I get it. I hate Turians. I thought you'd be glad. I don't know if I'll be coming down here for these talks anymore. Whatever. Don't have to be friends to fight good enemies. Just thought you'd like to know I'm finding reasons for my own battles. Hey. Tell me about you, Jack. I'm still finding out about me. Thanks for letting me look at these files. If they're helping you, that's good enough for me. Don't be my buddy. You need me to kill for you, I need you for these files. Let's leave it there. Your friends at Cerberus are into some nasty things. 
I'm gonna find something I can use. I just know it. What if the answers aren't what you expect? I'm not looking for answers. I'm looking for names, dates, places. What happens when you find what you're looking for? I go hunting. Anyone who's screwed with me pays. Their associates pay. Their friends pay. The galaxy's gonna be a lot emptier when I'm done. What's your history with Cerberus? They raised me in a research facility. I escaped when I was a kid. Been on the run ever since. And they've been chasing me ever since. But soon, I'm gonna chase them. You don't have to live in this pit, you know. It's dark, quiet, and hard to find. That spells safety to me. You know, this ship is a powerhouse. You could go pirate. Live like a king. I could help. We have to stop the Collectors. I don't have time for piracy. When this is done, we'll either be dead or out here in space with this ship. Think about it. Lots of creds. Freedom to go wherever you want. And all the mayhem and fighting I could want. What is it about killing that fascinates you so much? I figure every time someone dies and it's not me, my chances of survival go up. Simple. I should go. Yep. Hey. Tell me about you. I'm Jack. done talking. I should Come go. Back. Yep. Wishes to speak to you in a debriefing room, Commander. Shepard, I think we have them. Horizon, one of our colonies in the Terminus systems, just went silent. If it isn't under attack, it soon will be. Has Morton delivered the countermeasure for the Seeker Swarms? Not yet. Let's hope he works well under pressure. There's something else you should know. One of your former crew, Caden Alenko, is stationed on Horizon. Last I knew, Caden was Alliance. Why is he out in the Terminus systems? Officially, it's an outreach program to improve Alliance relation with the colonies, but they're up to something. And if they sent Commander Alenko, it must be big. I suggest you take it up with him. The Collectors just happened to pick a colony with one of my former it crew? It shouldn't be a surprise the Collectors are interested in you, especially if they're working for the Reapers. They might be going after him to get to you. We should send a message to the Citadel. The Alliance can give us reinforcements. Not until you investigate. I don't want the Alliance getting in our way. Once you have the situation under control, I'll send the message personally. Send the coordinates. We'll head straight there. This is the most warning we've ever had, Shepard. Good luck. Joker, set a course for Horizon. I've got to go see the Professor. Aye, aye, Commander. Tell me you have something. Yes. Lilith, we've got a problem. Still can't calibrate the targeting matrix? Those defense towers are useless if we don't figure it out. Sorry, Commander. Getting our comm systems back online takes priority. Yeah. Okay. 
Surprised people haven't tried to blame that one on me, too. People out here don't trust the Alliance. It's nothing personal. What is that? Get everyone to the safe house. I'll cover you! Run! Hurry! Assuming control.
We're groundside. Mort, are you sure these armor upgrades will protect us from the Seeker Swarms? Certainty impossible, but in limited numbers should confuse detection make us invisible to swarms. In theory. In theory? Experimental technology. Only test is contact with Seeker Swarms. Look forward to seeing if you survive. Collectors must be blocking us. We're on our own now. Those things look like the husks the Geth used on Eden Prime. Didn't that Geth stuff come from Sovereign? Then your elusive man was right. Collectors must work for the Reapers. This looks interesting. Colonists. No. On Eden Prime, victims were impaled on giant spikes to turn them into husks. I haven't seen any on Horizon. So the Collectors had the husks, and took the colonists alive for something else. The Collectors must be experimenting on the colonists. What are they up to? Sounds almost worse than what Cerberus did to me. Guess we'll find out when we stop them. These aren't the same creatures I fought on Eden Prime. They're more advanced. Evolved. They still die when you shoot them. The Collectors aren't getting away with more victims. Let's move out. Whatever you say, boss man. Your people... gone. Peaceful. Usually takes a lot of chemicals for me to get this kind of quiet.
What is this? A stasis field? Leaves them helpless but aware? They've been like this a long time. Is irrelevant. 
company. Get out here, now. You're... you're human. What are you doing out here? You lead them right here. You had to hear them try to get in. Seems like it's hard to hide from the collectors. Those things are collectors? You mean, they're real? I thought they were just made up, you know, propaganda to keep us in Alliance space. No, oh, they got Lilith. I, I saw her go down. Sten, too. They, they got damn near everybody. What's your name? What do you do here? Name's Delan. Mechanic. I came down to check on the main grid after we lost our comm signals. And I heard screaming. I looked outside and there were swarms of... bugs. Everyone they touched just froze. I, I sealed the doors. Damn it, it's the Alliance's fault. They stationed that Commander Olenko here and built those defense towers. It made us a target. Tell me more about this Alliance rep. Commander Olenko? Heard he was some kind of hero or something. That made nothing to me, though. But rather he'd stayed back in Council space. Any idea what he was doing on Horizon? Supposed to be helping us get the defense towers up and running. I got the feeling he was here for something else. Spying on us, maybe. Tell me about the Colony defense towers. A gift from the Alliance. High-powered Guardian lasers. Supposed to keep hostile ships from landing near the colony. Had to build a massive underground generator just to give it enough juice. Only we couldn't get the targeting systems online. So the Alliance gave us a giant gun that couldn't shoot straight. Stupid sons of bitches. Why do you think this is the Alliance's fault? We're just a small colony. Nobody bothered us before we started building those damn defense towers and drew attention to ourselves. I left Council Space to get away from the Alliance. Nothing good ever comes from getting mixed up with them. The Collectors are targeting remote colonies. The Alliance was trying to help. I don't need their help. Too many strings attached. That rep said he was just here to get the towers online, but mark my word, there's more to it. If you have defenses, we can use them against the Collector ship. You'd need to calibrate the targeting system first. It's never worked right. We can figure it out. Just give us the location. Head for the main transmitter on the other side of the colony. Pretty hard to miss. The targeting controls are at the base. It's probably just better if you stay out of the way. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, too. I'll let you out, but I'm locking the door behind you. I'm not taking any chances. Good luck. I think you're gonna need it. Marks.
This might be useful. How come we don't see more frozen people around? Probably loaded onto the collector ship by now. Guess they're almost done here. Right. Got it. Transmitter. Normandy, you copy. Joker here. Signal's weak, Commander, but we got you. Edie, can you get the colony's defense towers online? Errors in the calibration software are easily rectified, but it will take time to bring the towers to full power. I recommend a defensive posture. I will not be able to mask the increased generator output. The collectors will try to stop it. Good. Got any other helpful tips? Just one. Enemy reinforcements are closing in. I suggest you ready weapons. Assuming control. Take cover. On it. I know you feel this. On the ground, now! Yeah. 
gotcha. We bear homage to your destiny. Your form is fragile. Impact shot! My attacks will tear you apart. We need that system online. Don't know what that is, but keep back. Get away! There's nothing we can do. They're gone. Half the colony's in there. They took Egan and Sam and, and Lilith. Do something! I didn't want it to end this way. I did what I could. It was a good fight, Shepard. Shepard? Wait. I know that name. Sure, I remember you. You're some type of big alliance hero. Commander Shepard. Captain of the Normandy, the first human specter, savior of the Citadel. You're in the presence of a legend, Delan. And a ghost. All the good people we lost and you get left behind. Figures. Screw this. I'm done with you Alliance types.
thought you were dead, Commander. We all did. Been too long, Caden. How have you been? Is that all you have to say? <laughs> you show up after two years and just act like nothing happened. I would have followed you anywhere, Commander. Thinking you were gone. It's like losing a limb. Why didn't you try to contact me? Why didn't you let me know you were alive? I was out for two years. You've moved on with your career and your life. Why reopen old wounds? I did move on. At least I thought I did. But now we've got reports about you and Cerberus. Reports? Wow. You guys are slipping. Alliance Intel thought Cerberus might be behind the missing human colonies. They got a tip this colony might be the next one to get hit. Anderson stonewalled me. But there were rumors that you weren't dead. That you were working for the enemy. Our colonies are disappearing. The Alliance turned its back on them. Cerberus is the only group willing to do something about it. You can't really believe that. We both know what Cerberus is like, what they're capable of. I wanted to believe the rumors that you were alive, but I never expected anything like this. You've turned your back on everything we stood for. Caden, you know me. You know I'd only do this for the right reason. You saw it yourself. The Collectors are targeting human colonies, and they're working with the Reapers. I want to believe you, Shepard. But I don't trust Cerberus. They could be using the threat of a Reaper to manipulate you. What if they're behind it? What if they're working with the Collectors? Jeez, I hate these guys too, but they're not the only threat out there. You're letting how you feel about their history get in the way of facts. Maybe. Or maybe you feel like you owe Cerberus because they saved you. Maybe you're the one who's not thinking straight. You've changed, but I still know where my loyalties lie. I'm an Alliance soldier. Always will be. I've got to report back to the Citadel. They can decide if they believe your story or not. I could use someone like you and my crew, Caden. It'll be just like old times. No, it won't. I'll never work for Cerberus. Goodbye, Shepard. And be careful. Joker, send the shuttle to pick us up. I've had enough of this colony. Shepard, good work on Horizon. Hopefully the Collectors will think twice before attacking another colony. It's not a victory. We interrupted the Collectors, but they still abducted half the colony. That's better than an entire colony, and more than we've accomplished since the abductions began. The Collectors will be more careful now, but I think we can find another way to lure them in. Caden said the Alliance got a tip about me and Cerberus. Was that you? I may have let it slip that you were alive, and with Cerberus. You risked the lives of my friend, my crew, and that entire colony? Just to lure the Collectors there? A calculated risk. I suspected the Collectors were looking for you, or people connected to you. Now I know for certain. I told you I wouldn't sit and wait while the Reapers and Collectors gather strength. Besides, they would have hit another colony eventually, and without a way to predict which one, they would have abducted everyone. We have to make sure they don't abduct anyone else. I want the Collectors stopped for that very reason. That's why we're doing this, Shepard. I'm devoting all resources to finding a way through the Omega-4 Relay. We have to hit them where they live. Your team will need to be strong, as will their resolve. There's no looking back. The same goes for you. Can I assume you've put your past relationships behind you? None of your damn business. If it affects the mission, better you should leave it behind. Shepard, once you find a way through the Omega-4 Relay to the Collector homeworld, there's no guarantee you'll return. To have any hope of surviving, you and your entire team must be fully committed to this. Let me worry about them. You just find us a way to the Collector homeworld. I just want to be upfront about your odds. You'll need everyone at their best. I've forwarded three more dossiers. Keep building your team while I find a way through the relay. And be careful, Shepard. The Collectors will be watching you. I guess we're really gonna do it. Hit the Omega-4 Relay. 
take the fight to the Collectors in person. Looking forward to the action. After seeing what those bastards did on Horizon, though, makes you think. They're powerful, but we've got a few tricks for them. If anyone can stop them, we can. No argument there, Commander. Horizon just made it hit home. What we're doing, what we're up against. Gonna go take care of a little unfinished business. I imagine everyone else is, too. Getting some closure, you know? Sorry, I'm a little unfocused. Personal matter. It won't affect my duties. Always have time for my crew. What is it? As I said, it's a personal matter. I don't want to waste our time if it turns out to be a goose chase. But... Well, I got pinged by a ghost the other night. Family. I'm listening. My private log got an update about the Hugo Gerns back. The ship my father served on. It sent an SOS last week reporting a crash and requesting a rescue. Shepard, that ship went missing 10 years ago. I hadn't talked to my father for three years before that. I've buried everything but a body. Now, I'm not convinced it isn't just some automated distress signal ticking over. It's been too long. I think you'd be more excited that your father might be alive. He wasn't around enough for me to have bad memories. It's an old, well-healed wound. But if he's actually alive and needs help, I also want to note that it's not normal procedure for distress calls to be routed to the Normandy. This was passed to my personal log through Cerberus filters. Any signs that this was a Cerberus? I doubt the elusive man would let a direct operation stake hold this long. If there's a link, it's probably just about money. Cerberus needs diverse holdings to fund projects like... And whoever sent this my way covered their tracks. Someone could be fishing for fame. You didn't get along with your father? He made no apologies, I'll give him that. You make a mistake, you own up to it. Even if you keep making it. Whatever problems we had were a lifetime ago. I've had ten years to get to where I am. And as far as I know, he's still a ghost. Tell me about the Hugo Gernsback and what it was doing. Privately held frigate. I looked over the mission brief when... It Find an uncharted planet, stake a claim, and establish as large a presence. I think we can spare the time. I appreciate that, Commander. I don't expect... Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to Not talk? a good time. Trying to... Anything else? I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Incoming message from Admiral Stephen Hack at Alliance HQ. Commander Shepard, I need to discuss a sensitive matter with you privately. I'll take this in my quarters. Thank you for your time. 
I'll keep this brief. We have a deep cover operative out in Batarian space. Name's Dr. Amanda Kenson. Dr. Kenson recently reported that she found evidence of an imminent Reaper invasion. So why call me? Just this morning, I received word that the Batarians arrested her. They're holding her in a secret prison outpost on terrorism charges. I need you to infiltrate the prison and get her out of there. As a favor to me, I'm asking you to go in alone. What is Dr. Kenson actually doing out there? She's a deep cover operative, Shepard. We talk only when we have to. I'd heard she was investigating a rumor of a Reaper artifact in the system. Her last report said she'd found it. What else can you tell me about the operative? Amanda's a top scientist and Alliance agent working in... She and I go back pretty far, Commander. I thought the Alliance denies the Reaper threat. That must be some proof she found. Kenson's team found an artifact out in Batarian space. She believes it's a Reaper device. Proof that the Reapers are indeed... I've known her a long time. If she says she has proof, it's worth checking out. The Batarians won't take this time... This is not... You keep this quiet, Shepard, and there's nothing to worry about. I'll make this a the priority. Prison, once she's secure... Confirm. Got it. Pack it out. Shepard, I find myself in the unpleasant position of asking for your help. I don't like discussing personal matters, but this is important. Miranda, you're one of my crew. Tell me what's on your mind. You remember what I told you about Father? Building a dynasty? There was another reason I went to Cerberus for protection. I have a sister, a twin, and he's still hunting her. She's living a normal life on Ilium, safe and hidden So you think your father, father is tracking Precisely, her Precisely, Commander. My sources indicate he knows that... I've tried to keep her hidden without impacting her life, but I'm out of options. He's too close. I need to relocate my sister's family before it's too late. What do you know about your sister? She's my genetic twin. But she deserves a normal life, and she's going to get it no matter what. Does your sister's family know about this? Are they okay with being relocated? They know nothing. I told Cerberus, and they're coming up with a positive reason. What do you to need me to do? My contact's name is Lantea. Weren't you originally stationed on Horizon? Yes. If I hadn't joined Cerberus, I'd be abducted by the Collectors right now. Wow. It really does the full Yeah, I couldn't take that. Shepard. Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calendar. Talk to you later. I'll be here if you need me. Shepard. Just checking in, making sure you're acclimatized. Humans up. talk too much. That's all Shepherd. for now. Hey. Tell me about you, Jack. What are you up to? Still checking out your ship. Wouldn't mind putting her through her paces when you're not around. 
I doubt Joker would appreciate that. At least not while we're working. Relax. Joyriding doesn't have the thrill it used to. Besides, if I wanted it, I'd take it. That's so? I've been around. Ran with gangs, wiped out some gangs, joined a cult. Kept the haircut. I learned how to survive and not be a victim. It's hard to imagine you in a cult. That usually involves a lot of rules. I was looking for answers. Drugs and sex and going to a better place. A better place, right. It was all about money. They wanted to take a colony, shake the suckers down to fund their spread, and guess who was their ace in the hole? They were just like the rest. Didn't give one shit about me. What did you do when you found out? What do you think? It's hard to imagine uh, you would... They were just like the rest. Didn't you must have met some good people, too. Everybody wants something. And because of that, everything is fair game. Murder, assault, kidnapping, drugs, stealing, arson. Done it all. And that's the boring shit. Piracy, theft of military craft, destruction of a space station, and vandalism. That was a good one. Military's a hard target. Bet that means... Shouldn't have left the thing unlocked. Besides, parades are boring. I helped. A space station. You're pushing what I can believe. Ain't saying it was easy. Not everything is spur of the moment. Sometimes you gotta work to... Had some people I hung with for a while. Outlaw colony. Felt like they were like me. Guess that made us a nice... Turians think they know something about a scorched earth response. Fuck them. You were a pirate too? Ties in with the kidnapping. If you hijack a passenger ship and don't kill everyone, anyway. Good lesson. Simpler to just kill them all. I'm surprised you'd even mention vandalism in that bunch. That's what the Hanar call it when you crash that space station I mentioned into one of their moons and make a new crater. They really liked that moon. Do you ever wonder if you could have done things differently? No. Shouldn't you? There's no reason I should be alive, but I am. You know why? Instinct. It's worked for me so far, and I'm not gonna change. Hey, Shepard. No one's ever asked me about this shit. It's strange to talk about. So fuck you. And thanks for asking. The new armor reinforcements really threw off the gravimetric profile. I saw the reports on Horizon, Commander. What you did was amazing. The report mentioned that Caden Alenko was there. How did that go? It was good to see you. That's good to hear. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should You have know? unread ma- Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. Take care.